this week is courage. The Bible often talks about taking courage or being courageous. You're going to discover some uh, Bible verses attached to this email that are going to take you from the Old Testament to the Gospels to the New Testament. And each of those instances is going to talk about courage. In the book of Joshua, you're going to read about how Joshua is being prepared to lead the people of Israel into the promised land after Moses has died. And the, 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 uh, the thing that God says to him is be strong and courageous. But the reason for that courage is because the verse right before that, God says to him, I will never leave you. I will always be with you. So be courageous. In the gospel reading, Jesus is walking to his disciples and they're on the water and they're terrified and he says, take courage, it is I. I am here. You don't have to be afraid. And in the, in the epistle reading, the, the letter of 2 Timothy, Paul writes that God did not give us a spirit of fear or timidity, but a spirit of power and courage. And the reason we have that spirit is because God gives it to us. The reason you can be courageous in the things you face in life, whether that's a a doctor's appointment or a big decision or a disappointment, the reason that you and I can be courageous is because Jesus is here. And that's where we find courage. Courage.